Hi everyone, Edison Vasquez I come and I hope everyone is doing well. Today we're discussing real estate and business. Most business owners dream of owning their own industrial building for their business. Everyone knows real estate can create wealth for owners over time, even if the business changes or closes. However, in many cases, business and real estate don't go together. Here we explain a few questions business owners can ask to determine if your business should own real estate. Number one, what is the projected rate of return of business and real estate? Compare the rate of return of business versus real estate. Amazon is a good example. They don't own real estate or most of the distribution or most of the real estate. They know that their business produces a higher return on their investment than real estate. So they use most of the capital for their business. In a lot of businesses, they can determine if the investment done in their business is higher than real estate that they should lease instead of owning. And over time, they will have a great return on their business. Vice versa, if the business provides a less return than the real estate. In that case, business should own real estate. Number two, will the business grow in the next few years? This is a very important question that owners should ask themselves before leasing or buying a property. If the business is expected to grow exponentially over the next couple of years, it's better to lease the space and let the business grow with the space as you can acquire more space for lease easily. If the business is expected to be consistent and not grow as much, it might be better to purchase the building and let the business stay in the building. Number three, is the preferred location available for sale? Nowadays, a lot of investment funds or investors own the real estate, so it might be difficult for the business to find the perfect space for sale. In this case, business should consider leasing and go with a lease space that will give them the location and the right space to fit their business. Number four, is it cheaper to lease versus buy? Business owners should conduct an analysis of leasing versus purchasing. Depending on the condition of the market, it might make sense to lease as leasing can be a cheaper option than buying especially in strong markets where the price are all-time high and are hard to find spaces for sale. So business owner might consider leasing versus purchase. In other cases, it might make sense to purchase because there's availability and the market is in favor of buyers. Number five, does the business require a lot of specialized equipment? This is important in the case of manufacturing or specialized distribution such as coolers or freezer or special equipment that a company might need for the business. In this case, the investment done in the building might even surpass the purchase price, which can be in the millions of dollars. So in the case of manufacturing or companies that require a lot of power or refrigerator, cold storage, it might make sense to purchase the building because the use is very specialized and it requires a lot of capital improvement, which in the long term, it makes sense to purchase the building. Hope this helps and thanks for watching us. Our team specializes in the leasing of sales of industrial space here in South Florida and throughout the country. You can visit our website, warehousesmarket.com for more information on industrial real estate and our latest listings. Take care, be safe. Thanks for watching and thanks for following us. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel to get the latest videos on industrial real estate. You can follow us on social media on LinkedIn, Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. You can always visit our website, warehousesmarket.com for all the information on industrial real estate and our latest listing. We look forward to hearing from you.